Yo, appreciate y'all tapping in. Now go on, like the video, and subscribe to the channel. Rumor, Identify as a multimillionaire. We back with, yep, some more Wack 100 content. What's going on, y'all? The Wack was laughing. Good burger. Make sure you follow all the rooms on the 100 side because the content over there 24-7. Now, Wack was talking about that boy Honeycomb Brazy and finesse two crimes. I mean, confess two times. I mean, arrest two times. I mean, finesse two times. Now, as we're all aware via social media, that boy Honeycomb Brazy done jumped way early and he already dropping music. But what nobody expected was him to diss somebody who we thought he was all in good standards with. Finesse two times. Yeah. Please click the items below the video and it'll take you right to the room and the shop. Thanks in advance. But like my bro said, I reserved the right to be wrong. And like I say, I identify as a multi-millionaire. Thank you for liking the video. Thank you for subscribing to the channel. Go ahead and get active down in the comments. You can hate if you want. It's all love, yep. That's it. That man would have died if he hey, was a dad. He 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 said it. He said it. Say, Brian. Yeah, when you gonna get back? This years later, but look, let me ask you a question, man. You got a certain uh, a website you go find these on? What? What you talking about? <laughs> it's like it dot com or something like that. Man, that man came out and made the song with Honey Comb. You, 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 you be on Facebook? <laughs> what's the What's the background to the beef on Honeycomb and uh, Finesse? Is there like a little background? Well, the background <laughs> is that he was that cool. Uh, I'm actually two, trying to get a better understanding of what we're talking about. So, can I get a little quick synopsis on the background, please? Yeah. Todd, I can't hear you. Did he go in the Matrix or something? Look, okay. bang, what happened? No, see, I just take that because that's what I'm I get it. I'm on bang, bang. Nigga, I want to hear the beef. I don't know what the beef is about. Hey, hey, see, aren't you from I don't want to talk about no name honeycomb. Yeah. 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 Yeah.
Tell me lie for grandma. So did the pit the grandma and grandpa know, or did it was you can't say that he ain't sleeping. Exactly. Man, you see, uh, you and see it hit the, the oxygen tank and blew body. up. He did, and blew the house did, up. Did yeah, what, what, I want to know: Did the grandparents get, or did it, it just the freak hit the oxygen tank and blew up the yeah, house? And blew up the, yeah, blew Which up one? That's, that's all what that happened. Sounds like yeah. Yeah, <laughs> Yo, that must have been a lucky shot. I'm not gonna lie. They hit an oxygen tank in the house. Hell yeah. I mean, <laughs> you got a, you, hey, bitch, I mean, you really really got a real deal. Depending on how many they put through some small little houses down there. Them they probably came through there just whopping at that shit. <laughs> <laughs> they up said wire, <laughs> federal wiretaps implica implicate accused of rapper Honeycomb Brazy's grandparents. So they have some wiretaps on there. That's, that's, that's just somebody, somebody's phones was hot. Uh -huh. How he get his name? Job. How did Honeycomb get his name? <laughs> That's the neighborhood. Where you from, the Honeycomb? The Honeycomb <laughs> Hideout. Yo, they go where you? I was in the Honeycomb Hideout. I was in the Honeycomb Hideout. So, do he put the dude um, out of Texas? Or he just saying that he was going to get finesse and finesse? Nah, he said he ain't going back to Texas because he said that they, they rode the red carpet out for him. But then, like he said, he wasn't with him. He said he with Junior. I mean, he said he for jazz and he fucked with the old man, but he said he, he, he didn't say Junior name, so it looked like he got some type of problem with Junior. He said he got to go to Alabama and for them, he ain't going back to Texas. He, he ain't saying to Junior, he signed to the old man. That mild tax must have something to do with Junior. So the people house, if he was in Texas shooting videos, smiling, just riding around with gold kids, ain't going to nothing. Honeycomb. <laughs> CL, you know the honeycomb uh, little hideout spot out there? No, his, one of his mans, though, is from my neighborhood. They, they always call them honeycomb? Where they live. Sweet home. Is it a project? It's a project? Uh. That's some Montgomery. I don't find in the gun. I'm from Opelika. Would oh, you call it the gump? gump? What's the, the gump? gump? Oh, yeah, it's yeah. Montgomery. That's nah. Montgomery. Oh, don't be doing Morocco. this like that. See how that's like that. Yeah. 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 Oh, yeah. Yeah. I, don't, I don't know nothing about that. I can't that speak nigga that. Gump. Wait, his name? Honeycomb Braze? So, what do So, what's his favorite yeah, cereal? Honeycomb. Honeycombs? <laughs> this, 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 what type of names is these? Man, I don't know what this is. We're going to get into that kind of thing. Oh, hey, no, I'm keeping up with it. Especially the dirty and talking right now that just got through crying because he got about two yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh. <laughs> 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 shut up, shut up. Laughing hard as hell. Oh, you mad again? You mad story. again, huh? Hey, hey, hit dog. I'm sorry, bro. We need a recap on that story. I'm sorry, you emotional. Yeah, I'm gonna, I'm gonna, I'm gonna find a video. I'm gonna switch up to this booster content real quick, dude. I think booster actually got a mother case in this mother store on his, on his suing spree right here, actually. If he ain't get his money credit, but he you he soon ride wave. And let y'all hear what the fuck he had to say about that. Yeah, so he and that just redid the hook period. So he definitely it's definitely like um some rocks has gotta be handed over for that shit. But did ride wave do the business with the with the the right people? And Booster just ain't get his cut. Yeah. Well, what song is it? It ain't. It did Boosie sample it? Cause if he sampled it, they they might have went to whoever controlled the master. That's what I'm. Well, nah, it ain't no. Um, it's it's Boosie. He Boosie wrote it. Is this? You ain't talking about who wrote nothing. What you mean wrote it? Talking about the beat, right? What he claim? Nah, he didn't sound but he didn't he didn't sound for the I don't know if he sound It's the, the lyrics. It's just the lyrics. It's the lyrics. It's the actual. So what's the, what's the lyrics? What's the hook? Let me play it for you right quick again. It's publishing. It's just pub. That's it. They gotta give up some of the pub. Now nah, with a could that's that still happening the day where like a lab, a major labor put something out without handling that business? Or you think that they handled that business and he it ain't got to him yet? Nah, they just didn't clear. They probably didn't even they didn't catch it. Mm. 
Cause that song by Boosie was that one of his big songs? Probably what? not really. Nah, that's from two thousand. That's the that's the album that came out when he was locked up in two thousand. Yeah, he probably didn't catch it. It wasn't a big record like this, though, man. Yeah, and the writers, whoever wrote that, shit did that. Rod Way probably didn't even know about it. <laughs> you ain't lying, but yeah, they just they demoed that. Boosie for he, he. So he probably got a yeah. He got some grounds on that. For this. And he um like a function. It ain't nothing but some pub money. And see that that album went platinum. That album doing real good on the charts. Got nothing to do with the album, bro. Got something to do with the song. Can't claim a man's album. Yeah, that's a fact. Only the song. Only the song. Well, I, I said that because. I think that's why he for sure making a big deal out of it because the album doing so good and that song on that album. It doesn't matter. I know it don't it's matter. I, I understand what you said. I understand what you said. Only the song. Well, when you say publishing, does that mean he has to get a percentage of it or he has to? What's that? Yeah, what's that mean? Yeah, because yeah, it's on the writer side. So he's saying you use something that's already used as mine. So he got to clear it. And even with clearing it, you're still supposed to give it as published. So, I mean, he ain't doing nothing but helping the song right now anyway. Now, would it be, be better for him? Just a question, would it be better for him to try to get the publisher money or try to say, well, let me get it or on, on whatever project I got, like for a swap or whatever? He can do both. Cause he can say, I'm not going to charge you, but just give me my pub and I need to swap. He can zero out the fee. Replace the fee with a swap. Let's see if this is going to entertain it anyway. Oh, Rod Wave ain't gonna respond. That's what I was saying in my head. He's not gonna respond. <laughs> and there it go, man. Another one done. Another one in the books. Whack 100 clowns, honeycomb braids his name and calls finesse two times a rat. Again, though, this ain't the first time. We remember he had the guys that he was about to fly out to the podcast room that had the information on finesse two times since on the case. Something came up around that time. I forgot what it was, but it took the attention away so he didn't really get that full hundred side paperwork exposure run. And we all know when Whack and the hundred side get the exposing, then blogs get to talking. Now we can get to opinions and right and wrongs and all that. And but right now, let's talk about male BBLs. Fatness two times, went under the knife for the band man Kevo treatment. He's getting him a fat reduction from his busted can of biscuit body. This bag of water built that boy ain't been liking some things about himself for a minute. And now he got the money to change him, and he ain't finna do it. I can't say I blame him. Hey, you don't like how your teeth look? You damn near 40, too old to be getting braces. Go get some veneers. I ain't mad at him. Hey, you trying to get your body in shape, but your body's an odd shape, so you always look out of shape. You gonna get that corrected. I really can't say I blame him. Listen, if you was built like the lunch lady, or if you was built like the girl who drive the box Chevy with the with the basketball shorts under her sagging pants with the tank top on, you just did all them years in prison doing burpees still to have a segmented stomach in the back arm of an overweight auntie, and you got the money to get it done, take the time off, heal up, hire trainers and nutritionists to help keep you in shape. No, it's not natural. No, it's not safe. No, it's not necessary. And no, I ain't mad at you. It's your life. Do what make you happy because the time you expect it might not be promised to you. Prodigy of Mob Deep supposedly passed away eating eggs. Come on, bro. So who am I to remind Finesse two times of all the dangers of surgery when your breakfast might be more fatal than your cosmetic upgrade? But hey, I'm not a medical professional. This is not advice. This is only my opinion. But like my bro say, I reserve the right to be wrong. And like I say, I identify as a multimillionaire. Rumor, Naughty Network. Like, comment, subscribe.